Heyo, people! I'm back again today with another set of oddities for you. Welcome to Desolate Desert. As usual, we are starting from the five new ones, then covering the ten old ones. For Ancient Ruins Mystery, Ari Jones is excited about a new archaeological dig site. Ask him about it and he will give you some tools to take over. Bring the tools over to Sashabu to complete this one. While you're here, talk to Sashabu about the dig progress. He'll ask for your help and turn you into a robot. Head over to the damaged ruins and investigate them using the option dig into the ruins and take a look to get your hands on the relic box. Then bring it back to Sashabu to finish archaeological dig. For the next one, Ancient Guard, you'll find that you are still a robot, and you may have noticed that you have a skill we haven't used. Head on over to the Guardian of the Mechanism and take him out using that skill, then hand the clue over to Sashabu to finish off this one. Next we have Cultural Relic Mystery. Bruly Booly has got a clump of soil he thinks is related to the rune, so he asks you to investigate. To start, right-click the clump to take it to the water on the opposite side of the map to rinse it off. And then turn it in at the nearby ruins. You'll get a machine gear when you finish this. Note that the green mark on these ruins will not vanish. In fact, if you count on the map, there are 16, not 15. This one is extra. And as for the last of the new ones, you'll take that gear that you just got from the ruins and take it over to the machine next to Ari Jones and install it to bring it back to life and a complete lost civilization. Next, we're on to the old ones. For Unforgettable Love, Prince Charlie is looking a little not himself. Uh, if you remember what happened last time, you'll know why. He gives you a list with a ring circled, but you've still got to suggest every option to him first, and once you have three stacks of suggestions, you can finally suggest a ring. Okie dokie, pal. Good luck with that. For End of the Holy Fire, have a chat with the Holy Fire Emissary. They like to run a lot. Ask him if he's waiting for someone and he will give you a stick to stop the ghost you may have seen running around this map. You can find the ghost along this path somewhere. Just target him and use the stick on him. He loops back and forth, with the turnaround spot being where the gap in the red is. After you give him a good thwack with the stick, he will be bathed in a glow of light for a few minutes. Turn into Lani before it vanishes to complete the oddity and get Elemental Flame, which we will use later. For Now This Is Love, Sydney has fallen in love with a woman that he finds to be terribly unkind. Ask him what's up and he will tell you that the woman he fell in love with told him he has to touch water, which he is scared of, if he wants to date her. Take him over to the waterfalls by the Dimension Hall to complete the oddity. He will also give you an elemental metal shard. Resurrect the love machine? Hey, it's Asimov, and he's soaring vengeance against someone who ruined his robot. Doesn't ring a bell. Ah, right, no, he remembers us. He'll give you a list of goods to get to repair it. He needs a circuit board, pliers, and a toolbox. You can grab the circuit board from the mound right next to him. You can get a toolbox from Bellamy if you promise not to use them for evil. and you can get pliers from Princess Aubrey, but uh, I don't want to know why she has them.
hand all three over to Asimov to fix his robo. For Legendary Fraud, Lyle is barking out a challenge to pull out the Legendary Sword in the Stone. He'll give you a pair of gloves to help get a grip, so right click them to pull it out. Unfortunately, you'll end up shattering it to pieces, so hand the pieces back to him. Watch out though, because he will take 500 silver from you when you do this. He'll also give you the elemental water crystal, and uh not shown, but if you stand by, he'll put the sword back together. For Let's Duel, Bellamy is obsessed with card dueling and he wants you to help promote his new game. He'll give you three invitations. Offer one to Lanny to get the Holy Fire matches. Offer one to Prince Charlie for the traditional black tea. And bring the last one to Yosef for his letter. And the tokens you got from those NPCs over for a deck of cards and to complete the oddity. You can open up that deck of cards for a fish card or an Eidolon card. Next up, we're doing I Finally Got It. Head on back to Yosef. If you got an Eidolon card from Bellamy and you're in luck, you can turn it in right away. Otherwise, talk to Yosef to get 10 more tokens you can use on the machine next to him for 10 more card packs to try to get an Eidolon card. But you can turn in either 10 lame fish cards or an Eidolon card to complete this oddity. Next we got, come here, let them eat dirt. Marvin seems to be in high spirits and he will give you a special sauce if you talk to him. Apparently the local delicacy in the desert here is dirt. Right click the sauce to auto path to premium eating dirt, saucy soil. Then hand it over to Marvin and that will net you one elemental earth and a complete oddity. For Mother Nature's Wrath, speak with the tiny treant Dragonwood to hear his tale of woe. He will transform you into a treant to take on the Lumber Thieves. They are hiding over here, and you have three minutes to show them what a treant can do. Use your new skill on the Lumber Lifters, then return to Dragonwood to give him the good news and get an elemental wood called Timber. And finally, do you need a candle? Princess Aubrey is bad news, but she caught your eye, so she will have you work for her or die. She wants a stick, a rope, and glue. She's... making a whip. Oh, Prince Charlie, please wake up soon. You can get a stick from the tiny treant. Asimov has glue. And Lyle has some rope. If 
use them together with the recipe to make her a whip and hand it over to end this and maybe end Prince Charlie. And that's all for the oddities, but you've collected five elemental crystals and done nothing with them, haven't you? Head over to the teleporter here to find your way to the secret area of the map. Use the crystals to activate the totems and then speak with the statue in the middle too. Well, I'll leave that to you to find out. And that is it for today. Catch you next time.